still make significantly less than men in the same positions. If a job description has a list of 10 qualifications, um, women will go, gosh, I only have nine of these 10, I can't apply for the job. A man would look out and go like, hey, I got number one, I'm good. One of the things that we as women tend not to do is ask for raises and go after promotions. Throughout the first two years, I didn't ask for raises. I started asking for raises as, a, as my role grew and I obviously felt like I deserved it. So I didn't want to come off feeling entitled. I think that it is important because in the long run, it's been the best decision to stay with U.S. Bank. There's been changes and so much more career growth. They completely shifted my position to something where I see so much longevity with U.S. Bank. It's always a push and pull. You always want to get paid more and companies always want to pay you as little as you can to stay. You should always be pushing and asking because it's very unnatural, I think, as a woman to ask. And I have found that all of my uh, male counterparts, my, exactly my same age, will always ask. I think I was always cautious because I'm like, well, you know, at some point I'm gonna have kids and like I don't wanna ruffle any feathers. It's gonna be tough already asking to take time off to go on maternity leave. And I think that was a mistake. I've now had two children while at this company and, and I regret not asking for more. I was just, you know, telling myself that I needed to do the kind of like stay low profile in order to not make it difficult for me to disappear to do what is totally normal to do. If they're not going to value me as an employee here, then this is not some place where I want to be for the long duration anyways. So that was a lesson learned. I, I try to be much more aggressive now. To have a career, you spend a lot of time with the people you're working with. And so if you don't trust them and they don't trust you, or you just, your personalities and the culture don't jive with yourself, you're just not gonna be happy. It's like knowing your own value. They're not gonna just like kick you out the door. You're hard to replace, you know, it's expensive to replace good employees. We have to take responsibility for some of this too and not suffer in silence.